on the 17th of January. It's Monday. I'm doing my roof and you know I knew they'd probably be spraying today. Kind of needed their assistance because I asked to be over 65 degrees and it was about 70 degrees. So I knew that well, with the chemtrails I'd be looking at more like 85. It feels like about 90 right now. But I wanted to show you this. Look at this. Even though it's this covered they're still inside here going at it, spraying us as we speak. Fresh one just went by. I mean, unbelievable. This ain't enough, huh? I guess not. Okay. Alrighty then. Whoever that is. So here we are. There's an airplane cruising over. And here's the full coverage we're getting today. Look at this. Unbelievable. Not only is it already like this, it's been this way all morning. They're working right in, in and out, in between it, spraying, spraying the life out of us. This is going to be a rough roofing job today. Damn. I'll tell you something, my, my stomach is really starting to hurt me right now. I ate before I came out here. And, ah. I don't know, I just, like, major stomach pains. And it's uh, not surprising me, so, gee, I wonder, wonder why that would be, huh? Alrighty then. Here's the last one they just sprayed. Look at that. Nice. Fucking great. Okay, so, you know, I don't know how you roofers deal with this, honestly. I mean, does it change, like, uh, what it is you're doing during the day? And, like, if, it's, if it wouldn't have been cold enough, if it wouldn't have been warm enough, maybe? Is it now, oh, there's some chemtrails? Does the contractor go, well, it should heat up about an extra 10 degrees? I mean, seriously, doesn't this affect your guys' work? I know it should affect your attitudes as a roofer uh, being out here in it, but this is... Friggin' amazing! It, I mean, hell, I'm obsessed with it as it is. Poor dude having a roof with me has to listen to me constant here, because I, I can't. And look at this! And look at this! Look! Oh my God! So it's all this covered, and here's this dude right now. What? What? Why do they have to have it that covered? I mean, God! Is this contract for me specially or something? I don't know. So tell me, roofers, uh, you're not concerned about this or what? Seriously. No, seriously. You, I, I think I'm going to start uh, talking to some different people here. People that work outside. And we already got, you know, landscapers. You got hikers. You got, but I'm thinking roofers, balloonists. You people are getting killed really fast. <laughs> and you're watching it. You better stand up and speak about it now while you can, because I'm not so sure you got a whole long time to be speaking about it. Gee, you know any other roofers that are getting sick? Nah, uh-uh, no, John, we got our roofers' life expectancies already up to 43. Why, is that, is that not normal? Yeah. yeah. Is it the chemicals they use in the roofing material and the, the clear coat? No, I, I'm thinking... Might be something else killing you motherfuckers. Just maybe. You think? Chris Askell, Real News Tucson. Overachievers is right, because check this out. It's totally overcast, and here's, here's another guy working it. Look at this. Can you see him? Way back there. There he is, just working it. 